All right, man, we back with another one. <clears throat> Y'all see the title, man. The number one benefit, I think, of having a nine-to-five job, and no, it's not that you get paid. <laughs> I think it forces you to have some form of order or discipline in your life when you have a job because you have a set schedule. Hopefully, you have a set schedule. You don't have one of them random jobs where you go in at random times. I... I I can't stand that. But when you have a set schedule like I do now, it you have you know you need to be at work from this time to this time. So you get to plan around it. And honestly, I think it makes certain things easier when you have a set schedule, when you have a set job because it through that through that order, through that discipline, you get freedom. You know what I'm saying? So when you're not there, or, or on the hours that you don't have to work or the days that you don't have to work, you get to kind of plan out and make things work because you know you have to be back at work, you know what I'm saying, at, at a certain time or at a, on a certain day, you know what I'm saying? And and I think that, because I'm not even going to sit here and lie, like I done did, I done spent plenty of time um, hating on jobs, hating on the system, blah, blah, blah. Look, man, <laughs> if you in that part of your life, if you in that phase of your life, like, do what you got to do, but hurry up and get over it because it ain't going nowhere. It's, it's, the system ain't going nowhere. It's what you do about it. You know what I'm saying? So once you get past that point, um, just make it work for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, perfect example. Like, I got to go to work right now, but I make it work for me. So when I get here earlier than I need to, I make a video if I got a topic on my mind. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm making it work for my advantage. Make your job work in your favor, you know what I'm saying, don't don't let it work against you, don't be like everybody else, oh, you know, I gotta go to work, and oh, I'm working full time, and shut up, like, I don't wanna hear all that nonsense, we don't got time to be bitching and crying, like, cause if you hate the job that bad, just fucking quit, like, nobody wanna hear you cry about work, dude, I'm sorry, you know what I'm saying, like, make it work for you, like, stop playing the fucking victim, and just... If it, even if your job is negative, like, or if you view it as a negative thing, like, turn it into a positive. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't. Uh, anyway, <laughs> make it work for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, have that. Let that order that your schedule brings you. Let it be your your gateway to freedom. You know, so when you're not there, you're taking advantage of it and you're doing those things and you're moving in the direction that, you know that you really want to be going in. Now, me personally, I think that you should get a job that is going to put you closer to or give you more information about the direction that you want to go in. So like me, I work at a health food store. I've been working here for like five years. Um, because this is something that I'm interested in. It's not the only thing that I'm interested in, but I'm very interested in health and fitness. You know what I'm saying? So I got me a job at a health food store and I've learned so much shit since I've been here and I've learned so many things that I can take with me even when I'm not here, you know what I'm saying? So I think that we got to be more mindful of what kind of jobs we pick. Like, don't worry about how much money you're going to be making and all that other type of stuff. I mean, unless you're taking care of somebody, you got a family, you got kids. I mean, I can't really say that to you. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I don't have no kids. <laughs> but if you, if you single or if you, you know what I'm saying, don't have any kids or whatever, like get a job that's going to put you in the direction that you want to be in you know, and allow that to be, you know, allow that it'll be even better with it being something that you're interested in, with it being some form of structure that's in your life, some form of discipline, you know, some form of order in your life that is putting you closer to or giving you more information about the direction that you want to go in in life, man. Um, Again, it, it, it like I spent that time, you know, complaining and thinking I'm supposed to be doing something better with my life and working a, than working a nine to five job. If that's how you think, bro, just go do it, you know? But usually when people think like that and you tell them to go do it, they have nothing to say. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, just don't be that person. Like, make your job work for you, dude. Like, simple. And if your job's not working for you, either figure out a way to make it work for you or get one that's going to work for you. Like, it don't make no sense to be crying about, you know, you got to make money. You got to you gotta pay your bills. You got to, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
that's not the only reason why we work, but that's a lot of reasons. That's the main reason why a lot of people go to work is to pay bills. You know what I'm saying? That's not how I think about it, but you know, a lot of people are like that, which is why a lot of people get jobs that pay a lot, but they hate it or, or it doesn't align with where they want to go in life. You know what I'm saying? So just make it work for you, man. And let the, let your work schedule kind of be a part of the foundation that you have set for yourself to have a disciplined life, you know? That's pretty much it, man. Hopefully that made sense. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one, man. Peace.